I just want to say fuck Jack Wire for this challenge. It's really confusing, and Fitz just threw some wild shit at me with yeah, some hey, weird information. Fitz. Fitz is confusing. Fitz, you're not helping, bro. You're being a bum. I mean, one, it's 12, and one. I got to clock. Yeah, one, like, two, what? one. One, two, one. I mean, we got room 121 right here. Right, one, two, one. Like, that's a little confusing. I looked at laptop or desktop number one, laptop slot number one in the cow. Yeah, I looked at, yeah, same. I looked at all the 12 signs, 12 man signs in the classroom. I went to the 12 yard lines. 12 yard lines. <laughs> I tried to find a cop car, the one, two, and didn't find <laughs> shit. There's an advantage somewhere at Ingemore. And all we know is that something's happening at 12. You'll get one or something. And don't be too late. And so we thought clock. And what's the biggest clock anymore has? That one. So we're checking here to see if there's an advantage in here. It seems like there's some footprints. Would you type out the number one? No, yeah, it's definitely no, part it's, of it. Definitely Jack's part very of it. strategic. Yeah, he is. I know, I know. You know. And I would type out one. Jack, I'd be so, so mad because I was about digging down there deep, but I was too lazy it's to do social game. I was so mad. Right. <laughs> no, fuck you, Jack. <laughs> Fuck That's bad social. social game. I don't give a shit. That is bad social game. I'm sorry, Jack's not going to off. <laughs> bad social game. <laughs> We're looking at clocks, and we don't see anything. So this is tough. Yeah, I'll tear this whole campus apart if I have to. Do it. I dare you. Okay, Ross. So, James, you will get one. And it means yearbook. The next number will be three. We're going to the yearbook so room. So think of something relating to time into three. It definitely means yearbook. Exactly. A Don't be late be because you can't so pay for it late. Yeah, it could true. be on the clock in the yearbook room, but it's something to do with time and yearbooks. We saw Jack post the uh, the thing on Snapchat, the Inglemore Snapchat, about the big clock that we were just at. It's me, Connor, coming back over here. We're looking for it. Ooh. Oh, there's your bottle. Oh, I left it out here. I don't see anything. We've come to believe that the advantage will be placed at Inglemore at the board at 12 o'clock, which is in about 30, 25 minutes. And so me, Chin, and Connor are going to be there. 12 a.m. on a school night. Don't even talk to me. Don't even. <laughs> what? We're surviving. Yeah. Outwit, outplay, outlast. So what's the deal? You guys are all gonna get the advantage? Yeah. I mean, how's that gonna work? Wait, is there only one? There's only. <gasps> all right, we're driving to our advantage right here. <laughs> Found out it's on the football field, the 50 the yard 50 line. The 50 yard line. This is gonna no, be. No, I was decided we're probably gonna park right here, get out and uh. Go on foot to see what we're about to find. <laughs> um, I'm about to get a little dark because we're about to turn off the lights, but <laughs> just listen to my voice. I'll still be there, all right? Ooh, let's get it. Let's get it. Boy, see, look at that. Dark, and I'm done. <laughs> I'm now invisible. <gasps> that's huge. Oh, dang. That's nice. <sighs> okay, Mason just touched it first. <sighs> I love what's happening. I'm glad we got the immunity idol. I think that's something that we can easily share with each other and something that, you know, I, th I think we're developing a good, like, I, th I think we can be chill in this game, you know? And that that's a good thing for us. I really wish I was the first one to touch it just cause like I would've been more confident, but I trust Mason, I trust him. I feel like he can get me far and we can get each other far. Of course, I want the extra confidence. I wish my fingers are on it. And we started, we can't, I came over here to Keegan and it was on the 50 and it's cool though, it's cool though. I'm really, I'm really pumped that like, at least someone I know got it. Like, it's not some stranger, but we're about to do good things with this idol. We're about to do real good things. It's about to be nice. I'm definitely happy that I got it instead of Chin or Connor because um, in the end, it's a single person game. Uh, you really need to look out for yourself out here. Um, and alliances get you far, but in the end, it's you that carries you. The only thing that you can trust in this game is things that I say in the game and things that are written in parchment. See, there's no, no parchment with this. Yeah. This is not an immunity idol, but there's no reason why anyone would think it's not an immunity idol. Oh, this is a 100% authentic fake immunity <laughs> idol, okay, that has zero power except for the power that's in your brain. 
So apparently Jack just told me this is a fake Minity Idol. Um, I'm actually more happy about that because I don't want to ever give up a real immunity idol. I think that's for me when it comes down to it. So now that I have this, um, I can try and use it to gain someone's trust. I'll be able to hand it off to someone who I think should really be going home and maybe they'll play it at the right time or I guess the right time for me and they'll go home. So fake immunity idol, it's going to be very important this time. Very important.